Yo, what's good, YouTube? It's your boy Jay back here with another vid, man. Hope y'all out there um, staying on y'all purpose, man. Getting to these goals, you know, doing what y'all supposed to be doing. Um, so I was just thinking over the weekend, man. It's a Monday, you know, start to the week. Apologize if I'm looking kind of sleepy, you feel me? Was grinding all weekends, whatever. Um, but over the weekend, man, I was thinking. I need, I want a new model for the channel. So up until this point, uh, y'all, I don't know if y'all seen like my little intro vid or what I'll be talking about on the channel or whatever. But that's not the overall message or value I want to convey or whatever, you know? So I was thinking, I really got this uh, idea from Twitter. This is dude I follow on there. Uh, his name Lobo or something like that. <laughs> but basically the whole mindset is just train everything. So that's what we, I mean, moving forward, man, that's what, that's what's going to be the motto. That's what's going to be like the focus. That's going to be like the direction I want to head with the channel, whatever. Now, let me explain a little bit what that mean or whatever. So by training everything, it's essentially just a mindset on how you attack everything in life. Um, so I just got done reading, you know, Can't Hurt Me. Um, also, Jim, Jim Rohn, uh, Jim Rohn uh, the Ultimate Jim Rohn Library or something like that. And both of those just started putting shit in perspective for me. Like, okay, why can't you do certain things? Like, the society likes to tell us a lot, like, oh, why do you want all that money? What are you going to do with it? Blah, blah, blah. Like, why not? Or, oh, you you just a workout freak. You're a health freak. You just go to the gym. You care about health too much. Why not? Oh, you blah, blah, blah. Whatever you do, society always going to have some shit to say. So, to combat that is really um, just to train everything mindset. Like, why not be great at everything? Why not? That's simply the question that, uh, that was how Jim Rohn ended his little s s seminar or whatever. It was just like, when people ask you why, just ask why not? And that's real shit. Like, I feel like anything I put my mind to, I could do. And I could do to the highest level. So, why not make as much money as I can make? Why not get the best body I can get? Why not be as healthy as I can be? Why not help as many people as I can help? Why not uh, have the best social life I can have? Why not go to the most countries I can? Why not eat the best food I can? Why not train every fucking thing I do? So, then when you're taking this approach, you look, you look at everything as like a science experiment or an experiment to where you can get better. You don't just look at that trip to the bar as a trip to the bar. You look at it as an opportunity to be like, okay, bet. Like, who's in here? Who's in here? Who can I network with? Who can I, how can I increase my social skills? Um, and then you start taking the objective steps to get better at certain shit. So you, you always want to look at yourself. Um, this was in the Can't Hurt Me book, the accountability mirror. You always want to look at the mirror and be completely honest with yourself like, all right, shit, so what can I get better? What am I lacking at? What am I putting too much effort in? So train everything, and basically you're, you're, taking the, you're taking the focus off one area of your life and moving to something else uh, based on your necessity, based on your needs. So like, I feel really good in my physical, uh, just aesthetic, how I look, like weight I could be a little heavy I could be a little stronger whatever but as far as looks and stuff like that like I'm I'm getting there I'm kind of where I want to be that's because I really really hard at it the last couple of years so like I could take the foot off the gas a little bit with that aspect I mean not full physical like I'm still going you know go hard every day with athletics or whatever but now maybe I can incorporate some boxing in there or incorporate a different element to overall add to the full puzzle. Because what's looking good if you can't fight? What's being strong if you can't fight? What's any what's fighting good but not looking good? Like, 
I don't want to be Tyson Fury either. Back when that nigga was fat. I could throw them bitches, but he, he was fat. I'm not trying to be that either. I want to look good, fight good, shit. Be strong. I want all that shit, bro. Train everything, bro. Like... And once you adopt this mindset, you'll start looking for different ways to improve. And ways to improve will manifest them. They'll show themselves to you. Like, if you have a mindset, if I'm looking to improve all these different areas of my life, then they'll show you your way to it. Now, let me, uh, you know, get some structure to this. So, the way I'm going about it is, you know, you have, like, a big, like, four buckets in your life. You know, you got your wealth, finances, um, career, job, whatever, that's that sector. You got health, um, mental health, spiritual health, physical health. Um, you got that sector, then you got social or relationships, um, stuff like that. So, if you break it down in those buckets, um, wealth, that's like your anything you do as a career, anything you're doing to put value into the world expecting to get a monetary value back so what i'm doing right now this is increasing my wealth value even though i'm not directly getting paid for this video or nothing like that over time if i stay the course with this eventually i'll probably get paid for it or this will lead to more opportunities so i'm training something right now i'm also training my communication skills being in front of the camera speaking learning how to speak better learning how to articulate myself better um, I'm also improving my confidence and putting myself out there, breaking down uncomfortable situations. When I first started YouTube or whatever, I got uncomfortable. Like, it was an uncomfortable thing. It's something new. Anything, anytime you do something new, it's going to be uncomfortable at first. So that's why you got to just go head first into it and then shit over time. Time, bro. Time, time, time. It's the ultimate element. Time will fix your weaknesses if you pursue them that's why we young or uh, i don't know who's watching my channel really but while you're young or while you're at a certain age i mean even whatever age you're at man you got to use time as the ultimate asset because it is your ultimate asset the earlier you get started with stuff the better you're gonna be the sooner you get started the better you're gonna be the more effort you put into stuff the more better you're gonna be so like you really have to use time as that element now that's like the finances, breaking that down, figuring out what you can do to improve that sector. You should have goals for that specific sector. And then health. So you got mental, spiritual, and physical health. Like I already touched on physical a little bit. Then you got your mental health, um, meditating, um, reading, um, all these things that's going to improve your mental health. Like seek out ways. Like um, even me right now, like I'm super tired because I was going hard this weekend, but like, that's not good. Like, niggas be trying to act like grinding 24-7 is good. Like, I didn't get no sleep Saturday or whatever. But that's not how it's supposed to be. Like, the ideal is you have all these points of your life keyed in. You're training everything. Sleep is something you could train as well. How do you get the best quality sleep every night? Oh, well, you have to go to bed at the same time, wake up at the same time. You have to uh, not eat two hours before the bed. Turn off computer screens an uh, hour before bed. Uh, make sure you blacked out room certain degree temperature like all that stuff can be trained it's so much though but that always gives you something to aim for like you're never getting complacent there's always new goals to reach with this train every <gasps> with this train everything mindset and motto that i'm implementing to the channel you know so uh and then just like with everything man it just keeps on trickling down just keeps on going like spiritual health um, I'm a Christian, so the more I read my Bible, the more I pray, the more I worship, the more I listen to worship music, the more I strengthen that spiritual muscle, it's only going to improve my life. And also, I hope y'all noticing the correlation with a lot of these stuff I'm saying. It goes to other buckets in your life. If I get a better spiritual life, that means my mental life, mental health going to be a little bit better because I'm not so anxious, whatever everything's gonna fall in line with my mental health being better my sleep's gonna get better my sleep get better i'm gonna probably make more money so like all this stuff goes into a big bucket of your life and you're becoming the most valuable you can be um and then last one social a lot of people don't really see social 
as being something you could train but keeping that's a big huge part of life like keeping strong relationships with your family meeting new people exciting new people new people are what's going to give you new ideas new perspectives new uh goals new things that you didn't think was possible you meet a billionaire you really didn't expect like think it was possible until you met him and physically saw he was just a human just like you and he did the same things that you could do so human interaction is what strives humanity forward period so like when we collaborate link up whatever get better in these community type settings see social media is kind of trying to diminish that human interaction a little bit you know it's improved it in some ways but it's also uh trying to diminish it in other ways too like so disconnect from social media sometimes you know get out meet people meet girls meet dudes like interact like network um because all those stuff is just you know just train everything bro that's what makes that's what's gonna make it exciting like i want to end off with a uh, a quote from jim Rohn that basically sum it up it's like um what was the quote it was um become all that you can be because of the person that will make you hold up let me go get the exact quote i'll be back my bad y'all had to go get the uh exact quote or whatever man if y'all don't already get y'all a journal bro like fill it up get what you need in there you feel me it helps um uh, made me lose my page uh, uh here we go so the gym run quote it's like it says it's not what you get that makes you valuable. It's who you become. The person you become. So, like, it's not, oh, I want a billion dollars, then I'll be valuable. Or it's not, I need to be, it's just like, I don't know if y'all watching these, like, red pill videos or whatever like that. But, like, where they be talking about, oh, uh, act high value or whatever, all this high value stuff. It's not faking high value it's not oh i get this and then i'm high value oh i get the gucci clothes i'm gonna be high value oh i get the i get the lambo i'm gonna be high value i get a billy a billy i'm gonna be high value i get these houses i'm gonna be high value Ain't none of that shit gonna make you high value no cap it's about what's inside of you and all these things the pursuit of these things the pursuit of being great the pursuit of uh accomplishing the stuff you want to accomplish the pursuit of training everything that's what makes you valuable the person that makes you over time all those failures all those struggles only creates a stronger person over time all those mishaps all those learning all those experiences make you a more valuable person over time while we got the advantage while we young nigga we gotta seek all the experiences that we can get train everything become the best you could be because why not yeah man i don't know if this is motivational if this was whatever the fuck this the new model for the channel train everything this is what i'm on i'm doing social shit pranks um i'm doing self-improvement content i'm doing philosophy i'm doing whatever come to my mind fitness bro i'm doing everything on this channel everything because I'm in pursuit of being great, in pursuit of being my best version. And I hope y'all in pursuit of being y'all best versions. Um, so then we can all come together and be dope as hell together. You feel me? Meet up or something one day. But for whoever is watching, man, if you like the video, press the like button, please. It will help me get my message out there. Um, if you're new to the channel, consider hitting subscribe. You basically just watch the full vid on what this channel will be about man trying everything so if that interests you or you rocking with me or whatever it might be uh please do me a big favor and hit the subscribe button where are you watching this video if you haven't subscribed yet like come on now you know you want to watch more vids so you might as well subscribe whatever but yeah um i think that's it for this one i'll catch all y'all in the next vid i hope y'all stay safe and have a blessed week peace